Hi everyone, this is Diana Prince and this is Pin of Talk with host Diana Prince. I want to say thank you to everybody who's been tuning in to my live YouTube channel. Got a few more kinks I got to work out and get my audio um, together. I did a MAC tutorial, a MAC lipstick makeup challenge the other day because I started getting really interested and um, what's the difference between authentic MAC versus uh, the counterfeit, the real versus the fake. So based upon a lot of videos and tutorials I watched, I decided to do my own because I believe I have um, totally 100% real MAC lipstick and totally 100% fake. And I can see the difference in every way. So I did a tutorial on this and I'm gonna post it soon, but I wanted to go over all of my tips really super fast all in one quick little video on um, the things that I noticed right away uh, I took the lipsticks out of here but the first thing you're going to notice right away is the weight with the real authentic MAC it weighs more you're going to notice that right away and again do all of these things matter to me they matter because um, they're taking a name and that name brand has built a reputation for decades on quality so the first thing that I noticed right away is the box. When I opened up um, with the, it, the lipstick in there, you can clearly see the difference. Um, this is not falling apart. This is the real MAC. This automatically, with the lipstick even in it, was coming apart. It's, you can totally tell. One of the first things you're gonna notice is a dead giveaway. Um, MAC is going to be consistent with their lettering. They're going to be consistent with um, the type of paper that they use for their products. Everything is going to be consistent. It's not going to vary from okay quality to really great. It's always going to be really great. Um, so you're going to notice between the M, where the M meets the other M, um, the part of the M's meet, you're going to see a distinctive line there. On the fake one, the distinctive line is not there. And also, when I look at the tubes, there's inconsistency in the writing in the tube. It's not perfectly perfect like it is with the MAC. So, um, here's another thing. On one end, it says A45, and I'm guessing that that is a color code. On the fake one, it just has a sticker that says MAC. Um, when you open it up this way, it's going to have a sticker that's going to tell you your color. This one is Russian red. On this one, it says Listerine. I don't know what that is supposed to mean, and that's not a color. Um, also, on the flip side of the box, there is a barcode, and this barcode um, is a sticker that can be removed. This one is imprinted on the box. So, and then on the very inside of the flaps, it's going to say, um, on the real one, it's going to, um, hmm, interesting that I said that on the last, well, apparently they've got that part right, but um, everything is, if you, again, if you look at the M's, the M is going to be completely different, at least on the ones that are not the better counterfeit ones. The M is not going to have the space where it needs. So, now that we've looked inside the boxes and you can totally see the difference in the quality, um, I can hold this, what I believe to be real Mac, in my hand. And actually, this one is real too. Where did I put my fake one? Ooh, can I figure out which one's my, which one is the fake one? Which one is if I can tell by the end? There you go. Well, and I should be able to tell by the colors. I don't know. I'm worried about this one. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see if all of everything. Oh my goodness, it smells. Good. Okay. So I have in my hand three, and these are the three that I believe to be real. <laughs> I'm feeling them like it's gold. Um, okay, so the the real MAC, the box, the tube does kind of have a shiny finish on it, but it's more jet black. On the fake one, it's way more silver on it. Also, you're going to notice a very small line um, on either side where they can join the molding or however you say that when they made it. And so when you open it up, there's a line up the side 